differences between ARDL, County Integration Technique, and Johnson County Integration Test. ARDL, County Integration Technique, versus Johnson County Integration Test. The Autoregressive Distributed Lag, ARDL, co-integration technique is used in determining the long-run relationship between series with different order of integration. The reparameterized result gives the short-run dynamics and long-run relationship of the considered variables. Whereas, Johansson co-integration test is a statistical procedure used to analyze the long-term relationships between multiple time series variables. Time series is a sequence of observations over time, which are usually spaced at regular intervals. The purpose ARDL techniques is to analyze the relationship between two or more variables and handle both stationary and non-stationary data by incorporating lagged values of variables as well as their differences to capture short and long-term dynamics. Whereas, the purpose of Johnson co-integration test is to enhance the accuracy of models by capturing underlying the co-integrated relationships. ARDL co-integration technique is used to examine both long and short-run relationships between variables. Further ARDL model are useful when the variables are integrated of different orders. W. Harriers Johansson co-integration test is used to test co-integrating relationships between several non-stationary time series data. Developed ARDL model, introduced originally by Passaran and Shin in 1999 and further extended by Passaran et al. in 2001, takes into account a single co-integrating equation. Whereas, Johansson test was developed by Johansson and Gisellius in 1990 to confirm the long-run co-integrating relationship. ARDL co-integration technique holds significant importance in many fields by analyzing relationships in a single equation framework with mixed-order integrated variables. The ARDL bound testing method is used to define the co-integration association between natural log value of dependent variable and natural log value of independent variables. Whereas, Johansson co-integration test holds significant importance in the fields of econometrics, finance, and time series analysis for several key reasons such as long-term relations, diverse applications, multivariate analysis, portfolio management, mean reverting portfolio, hedging strategies, reducing spurious regression, policy analysis, forecasting and financial modeling. There are important factors such as carbon dioxide emission, mean temperature, mean rainfall, area under rice, fertilizer used, Agriculture policy are responsible for affecting rice production in which ARDL model is used by using lagged values of variables and their differences to capture short and long-term dynamics. Whereas, daily observed prices of the stocks, bonds etc. over a period of 10 years, one-minute stock price data for the last 100 days etc. in which Johnson co-integration test is used. The general equations of ARDL, County Integration Technique and Johnson County Integration Test are given for comparison to get idea how both method can work from scratch. The results of ARDL, County Integration Techniques and Johnson County Integration Test when entered data from MS, Excel to eViews or status software by giving proper steps or commands by getting above results. This example of ARDL, County Integration Techniques, and Johnson County Integration Test is for idea for beginners. There are certain assumptions for ARDL model to be used such as the variables X and Y are stationary. The expected mean value of the error term UT is zero. 
The error term is serially uncorrelated and the X variables are exogenous, at least weakly so, uncorrelated with the error term. Whereas, the properties of Johnson co-integration test are many such as multivariate approach, eigenvalues and eigenvectors, trace and maximum eigenvalue tests, order of integration, critical values and interpretation. In short, the ARDL model is considered as the best econometric method compared to others in a case when the variables are stationary at lag 0 and or integrated of order lag 1. ARDL is a better model than others to catch the short run and long run impact of independent variables on dependent variable. The ARDL approach is suitable for generating short run and long run elasticities for a small sample size at the same time and follow the ordinary least square OLS approach for co integration between variables. Whereas, Johansson test is a test for co-integration that allows for more than one co-integrating relationship, unlike the Engel-Granger method. But this test is subject to asymptotic properties, that is large samples. The Johansson County integration test is a valuable tool for economists, financial analysts, and researchers to assess the relationships between multiple time series variables and make informed decisions based on their long-term behavior. Johansson co-integration is specifically used when all the variables under study are stationary at first difference, while ARDL is a general method and is usable even if your variables are stationary at different levels such as lag 0 and lag 1. Kindly subscribe my YouTube channel Thesis Helper. Thanks for watching.